how to deploy the dart cloud function to the google cloud in dart instead of creating the whole server you can create a simple cloud function for small tasks and host it on the google cloud in this video we have created a simple cloud function to send an email and with the help of this cloud function you can directly send the email from your client app with your own email to the admin of the app first of all let's create a google cloud account next install the google cloud sdk after doing so you need to activate the dart fn tool with the help of this command now inside an empty folder create a new project using the following command now run the pubget command to install all the dependencies now you can see our generate command has created a dart server project where our server file is inside the bin directory and our cloud function file inside the lib directory inside functions file we have a default greetings cloud function which takes name as a request parameter and return the greetings message using the greeting model object in our case we want to take the email data from our client app then we need to send the email using the dart cloud function first we have replaced the old request model with the new request model for our data which we want to get from the client app second we have replaced the response model with the new model which we want to send back as the success message next we have created the email cloud function which will be called when we send the email data from our client app now to check it we can run our cloud function locally on our machine using this command you can see our server is listening on 8080 port therefore inside our client app we can use the local host 8080 as an endpoint to send the email now if we send the email from our client app you can see we have received the email from our client app to deploy this function on the google cloud we need to create the docker image of this function before that please make sure to have the docker running inside your machine first we will create the docker image using this command then we will run the docker container using the following command now you can see our docker image is running successfully and it is listening to the 8080 port now finally we will deploy our dart cloud function to the google cloud first you need to authenticate yourself in the google cloud platform using the following command if you have a project created inside your google cloud then it will choose it by default else you need to create a dedicated project and configure the project with the project id using this command then we will deploy our cloud function using this command now you need to choose the reason where you want to deploy your cloud function in our case we want to deploy it in first option also it will ask you to enable services required by your cloud function and finally you will be given a url to your cloud function which will act as an endpoint for our client app now inside your client app you can use this endpoint to send the email data by submitting the email data you can see we have received the email sent by the user